Myositis ossificans is a condition where metaplastic heterotopic bone develops in muscle, or it can also occur in soft tissue. So in some respects, the name is a bit of a misnomer. The lesions tend to be in the proximal extremities, particularly the brachialis, quadriceps, gluteus and soft tissues of the hand. It occurs most frequently in athletic adolescents, particularly males, and there is a history of trauma in over 50% of cases. The main and most important differential diagnosis is extraosseous osteosarcoma. So, so myositis ossificans presents as a painful swelling. This then becomes a circumscribed firm lesion forming a hard, well demarcated mass. And the lesions are characterized by the zonal phenomenon where there is a central cellular zone composed of fibroblasts, an intermediate zone with osteoid and an outer zone of organized bone. So the lesions start with cellular plump fibroblastic stroma with a periphery of osteoblasts, osteoid and woven bone develop, and then finally lamella bone and bone marrow may be present. Here is an x-ray of a focus of myositis ossificans. So on the left side of the picture is the proximal femur and we're zooming into a radio-opaque mass of calcified tissue and this is myositis ossificans. And this is the histological appearance of myositis ossificans. The top right of the picture is the cellular fibroblastic stroma, that is the inner zone. We're moving into the intermediate zone with osteoid and woven bone. And then at the outer zone is a periphery of well-organized lamella bone. And here is a low power view of a mature focus of myositis ossificans. And at high power, it can be appreciated that this lesion is composed of lamella bone containing bone marrow.